Hi, I'm Dan Gooding and I'm here in A Venue on Central Avenue bringing you the West Bridgeford Wire Winter Property Market Update. <music> 2017 has been all about the Brexit and no deal that we've got so far and uh, the talk of interest rates increasing at some point. Uh, towards the end of this year or early next year, which of course doesn't help confidence in the property market, um, which is all about confidence when it comes to buying and selling. So what we're seeing for the first time in a long time here in West Bridgeford is it shifting from being a seller's market to more of a buyer's market because of that lack of confidence. Some interesting data directly from Rightmove uh, about property prices for the East Midlands and West Bridgeford as a whole. The majority of sales in East Midlands during the last year were detached properties selling for an average price of £278,322. Semi-detached properties sold for an average of 166275 with terrace properties fetching £141,559 on average. East Midlands, with an overall average price of £198,520, was more expensive than nearby Yorkshire and the Humber. £183,265 on average, but was cheaper than the West Midlands at 211,003 pennies. And east of England, £323,426. The most expensive area within the East Midlands was Rutland, with an average price of £301,845. And the cheapest was Lincolnshire at £176,854. The majority of sales in West Bridgeford during the last year were detached properties selling for an average price of £428,451. Semi-detached properties sold for an average of 293533 with flats fetching an average of £184,960. West Bridgeford went up 32% from the beginning of 2014 compared to the East Midlands area as a whole, which was up 18%. Heading into winter and predicting what the rest of the year has in store for us, if we compare it to last year, December was a fantastic month for us viewing wise. We actually had a record breaking open day in December on a property in Lady Bay. What we're seeing and breaking with tradition is a large number of buyers looking for properties over the Christmas period and certainly the amount of visitors to websites like Right Move and Zoopla triples over the holiday period which makes it a very good time for people to get their properties on in December, really take advantage of that uh, extra exposure that they get from the larger visitor numbers. Property prices in West Bridgeford have always remained strong even through the recession and during this time of uncertainty with the Brexit no deal looming, I predict that property prices will continue to grow in West Bridgeford but probably not at the same level that we've seen over the last few years. Thanks for watching this property market update. I'll be back in the new year so I'll see you then.